How's it going everyone? Here I am with a NES tutorial. Now in this occasion I want to talk about one of my favorite uh, veterans of all the Smash Bros series. Like NES is one of the characters I enjoy the most playing. I don't know, there's just a thing that it's a combination of playing a character from a series that I enjoy so much, which is Earthbound. With the combination of um just interesting arrow moves and mobility and all these type of different powers. Crazy man. Now a couple of the things that change with this are first of all no more double jump cancel so you can you know double jump arrow cancel your your double jump <laughs> then he's down to feels weird you can do down to into near a her you can do like things like this Vicky Thunder is also very strong. He's Vicky Thunder 2. That's Vicky Thunder 2. Vicky Thunder 1 is this one. Which I think it's pretty good. It's a pretty good juggle, especially off stage. Dark Throw, this excellent kill move that's just incredibly strong. Incredibly, incredibly strong. Um, down Throw combos into Double Jump Upper or double or for. This is just very good in this game, I think, because fours combo into each other, so you can a low percent you can do things like no. Four throw has a very high, uh, has a very high trajectory or knockback when it throws people, but it doesn't really increase with damage. Like it doesn't do that at all. So it's very good for getting people off the stage, but it's not a kill throw. Back throw, on the other hand, it really multiplies with damage, so you should be using that. Also, Piggy Flush is very useful for edge guardians right now. You can do things like, you know, in that scenario, in that scenario he was just gonna die. Now, cool combos you can do in this. I like double jump upper. It's kind of hard to do it fast. There's a ton of damage. Also has a spike and he's down there. Nothing, nothing different than every game. And he's four smash, very strong. Also, he's down smash. And up smash are not useless anymore. They actually are kill moves now. And they do some damage. The downer spike is on the tip of the head. I don't think his downer is that good. It's very slow. It's at the startup actually. It's actually at the startup of the head. So yeah. Let's hop right into a match. See how it goes. Wait, 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 what is this raffle? I'm not raffling anything. <laughs> I'm not raffling anything. Oh my god, the whole chat is rifle now.
Don't mess around with Piggy Thunder too. That's the first rule. You get hit, you insta die. Don't die. Just be safe and stay on the stage, man. No, maybe grab the watch. Oh my god, he made mad mistakes, but overall, you can see how strong Ness's off the stage game is with Forders. You can get a general idea of it. But overall, one very important thing with Ness, I will say, is his management of Picky Thunders off the stage, 2 edge guard people, Picky Fires too as well. Overall, focus on using all of his abilities. Don't just focus on only one or two aspects of his game. Most of his moves, or almost all of his moves, are, are very useful right now, and you can find different uses for them so and then experiment that's the key like for watching